in the first moment of braveness is really working with our mind. And that is basically what we're doing in meditation, is gaining trust in our mind. How the mind thinks, how the mind thinks, especially about itself, is very important. So how we got up today, in the moment we thought, how did you think? You think good or bad, confident or non-confident, has a profound effect on the day. And if you believe in the power of your mind and heart, that's the most important thing. So when we're meditating, we are doing sort of a dance between what is really feeling in conceptuality. When the mind is brilliant, there are no conceptuality. So when you're meditating, what is a concept? It's a thought or fabrication, something arises. And what gives it power is as soon as we believe it. If we do not respect what we are doing, nobody will. Meditation is the point where we respect our mind and what we are doing. And I feel like, especially in terms of what we're talking about, the notion of society, Meditation becomes the ability to feel, and when we feel, we feel what others are feeling. Unless you have a strong purpose of how you would like to live deep, it is very difficult to change. And there are certain habits that all of us, you know, are, we're brought up in the certain things we do that are family and cultural. But then there are certain principles which I would say is more human like kindness and those are have no borders and those are principles that we have to feel good about and we have to strengthen and we have to implement <laughs> 